is about mapping a changing society through its advertising lens. So our society has been in transition, okay, and every society is in transition. But in our case, I think from around 1991, the society has started transforming a lot more rapidly than before. And we've been witness to this, this rapid change. You had various other books which have been written about the changing society through various lenses. A lot of books have come, but no one has looked at advertising and said, look, how is advertising reflecting changing society? So that's how the thesis started, and that's how I started working on this book. And then, for those of you academically inclined, uh, some of you may be aware of this person. Marshall McLuhan was the professor of English at uh, University of Toronto. He wrote a very famous book called Understanding Media. Uh, in Understanding Media, he coined two or three terms which are today, we use it without even thinking. And he also wrote, medium is the message for the first time. Okay, And he was vilified for that. People said, you know, what are you talking about? What are you talking about global village? What are you talking about medium is the message? But the truth is, he passed away in 1960 and then 30 years after his death, people started looking at his book and said, look, a lot of what he said is still so true, so valid. In the US, to set the tone right, Kurt Vonnegut, who is a very fabulous humor writer, uh, written books like Ajay Gandhi, curator of Hyderabad Lit Fest, will know, Slaughterhouse-Five, etc., etc. He said this, uh, that what passes culture in my head is really a bunch of commercials. So you have two contrasting views on that. but. You know, what makes sense? Why does it make sense to look at advertising? Makes sense because advertising often reflects change in society. And in some times, advertising actually predicts change in society. I have a picture of Hyderabad here. In 1991 or 92, we were looking to move office in Hyderabad. And there was one criterion just given. Satinarana used to do production, media, all kinds of things uh, for us. Only one criterion was used for selecting the office. The only criteria we used was where can we get a landline phone in one month? Because in nine, you won't believe it, in 92, 93, getting a landline phone in Hyderabad, many parts of Hyderabad, there was a five year waiting list. We have issues of poverty, we have issues of almost 35% of our children going to sleep you know, without food in their stomach. We have illiteracy, which is still plaguing us. And of course, the, the latest big problem is jobless growth. This book is not a historical book. It's not a, it's not a history book. It's a fun book which looks at changing society through various lenses. So we've got four sections in the book. First one looks at people, second one looks at product, third one looks at services, fourth one looks at advertising.